12 films in 12 months, a year in search of Shred. Different spots, different crews, different styles. We don't know exactly what's going to happen or where we'll go, but if it sounds fun and it feels good, we're in. Hi, I'm Cody Booth. It's June. We're here in Colorado and we're about to go do some snowboarding here in the Rocky Mountains. Well, now I'm looking for my dream girl. These coulars, you only get short windows out of the winter to really go ride them. Summertime though, it's like, man, they're good to go almost every day. You can get up there and you can go ride 50, 60 degree faces. I am well past 50 degrees, there's no marker. We're steep. Something a little bit different than your average, average summer boarding. i in the morning. Dream girl, I hope you learn. Dream girl. in the corners when I played at night. Dream girl, come out in the The physical exertion is pretty tough. You know, the, some of these approaches can be as short as a mile. Some can maybe be, shoot, we did one that was the other day that was close to 10 miles. You put a lot of hard work in, you get to the top of something, and you realize that, you know, that's why you're there. You, you did it all for the hike and the descent. Here we are, uh, 14,000 something odd feet. <laughs> Dream girl, come out in the light. I'm off the road. Well, I'm batted on up to Portland, Oregon. I heard there's gonna fall a blur. I got my ticket and I'll be there in the morning. Dream girl, I hope you're there. Dream girl. That was fucking intense. That was probably one of the more burly lines I've done. Waking up there. So I was stoked that Josh and Paul wanted to come out. I knew that they were kind of into some backcountry riding and uh, had a little bit of past climbing experience. So I think snowboard companies should have owners that you know appreciate all aspects of snowboarding. No, it's steep. It's 50, de 50 degrees sustained pitch is steep. It's legit. It's definitely a steep than anything I've done. One great thing about Cody and Nate, I mean, they are they're young, and these guys have really picked a challenging aspect of snowboarding to devote their lives to. You know, it's usually something that you think of crusty old mountain dudes getting after, and these guys are in their mid 20s, and uh, they're just going after it. In the corners, late at night, dream girl come out in the light. I say dream girl come out in the light, dream girl come out in the light. Yeah, I'm Josh Reed and I'm one of the two co-founders and owners of Rome. Uh, started with Paul Maravitz uh, back in 2001. You know, this episode of 12 months was really, really about just going and finding snow uh, in June. I'm up on a tight wire. One side's ice and one is fire. It's a circus game with you and me. I'm up on a tight rope. One side's hate and one is So we did a lot of fun riding and uh, just great to ride with Bjorn, you know, and watch him tear apart lines. And the wire seems to be the only place for me. A comedy of errors and falling. Like a rubber neck to rail. You look into my fan. Well, baby, you're just too blind to see. I'm up in the spotlight. These summer coolers, it's not it's not soft, forgiving snow. It's a little bit more survival snowboarding. What's really rad about the snowboard mountaineering side of it is that once you walk up, you don't you don't have to walk down. You can surf down. Bling, bling. 
funeral like family funeral pyre Put hang on show for you to see We've come across a lot of day hikers that are going to the 14ers, you know, and they see our snowboards on our back and they're like, oh wow, you guys are going to ride that? That's so cool. Everybody else is hiking up to get a workout and taking the view and we're getting a much better ride down. I got the last line of the trip. There's Cooley up here. Over and out. I think we we're lucky we had a great crew, um, great snow, awesome fun lines, and it's June and you know I, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna, I'm gonna still be out there riding. There's plenty more to do. I'm up in the spotlight. Oh, does it feel? Fuck this tree. Well, the altitude really gets to me. I'm up on a tire wire. Playing by life in the funeral pile. But I ain't gonna show you to see. So the uh, Rome guys decided to stop through town. Full last minute decision to jump on board um, and join these guys. Completely unprepared, but uh, we basically just went and did a couple lines, some slushy snow, made some turns in the middle of June in uh, Boulder, Colorado. It was great. Yeah.